it's show day. <laughs> I finished curling my hair. It is 8.15 in the morning. All I have left to do is my makeup. Everything is pretty much packed. All my meals are cooked that I could possibly need in the whole entire world because I probably over-prepared. I thought the show was a lot bigger than it was when I went to registration last night. I They said the show will be done by seven o'clock tonight, yet online it said it was gonna go till midnight, so that means the show's pretty small. I'm number 102, so hopefully that's someone's lucky number out there. I have to do my makeup still, but I have plenty of time. The venue is 15, 20 minutes from my house, really easy to get there. Um, but I just have been packing. I picked out my snacks before finals. I was gonna just do Reese's, like a Reese's cup before, but then I found these, peanut butter Snickers. I love anything nuts and peanut butter, I've mentioned that. Tons of my almond butter, extra contacts. Um, what is this, uh, dryer sheets for deodorant. Here's my suit, my number, my jewelry's in there. Shoes, tampons, pee cups, my bright pink obnoxious um, silk robe. I know people wear like black and purple, which is smart because you don't, I don't, I mean, I don't want to stain this, but I had a silk robe, so I'm not gonna go out and buy a new one. Change of clothes for when I go out to dinner um, and lunch in between the shows. Weights, all my, well, some snacks, flip flops, definitely. Let's look in the fridge. I got all my meals prepared and in there. I have my, just to remind myself, meal one is this. I'm really not hungry, but um, I have extra jasmine rice, extra meals, chicken and veggies. And then in there is four ounces of chicken, six asparagus, and a half a cup of jasmine rice. That's my meal two. And then I made extra meals just in case. You never know how long these shows are gonna go. And it's not necessarily for before pre-judging because I have my meal one, my meal two, and then rice cakes as I go. But if the, if the show actually did go till midnight and say I ate, everyone goes out for hamburgers in between um, um, pre-judging and finals, say after finals you got back and you were there for like six, seven hours, which I have seen in like national shows, but my this show I heard isn't even that big. I thought it was a lot bigger because it's a pro and amateur show, but guess not. Fun fact is I emailed Kara when she gave me my plan for peak week um, and show day. You know, like the typical thing, especially you see on YouTube, like you go out, you have a hamburger, you have red meat, you have bread, <laughs> sweet potato fries, and I emailed her back and I was like, Kara, I'm like the weirdest person in the world and I've actually never eaten a hamburger. Do you mind if I have like steak and bread and sweet potato fries? And she's like, that's fine, that's good. And I told a couple friends this and they're like, you, you've you never had a hamburger? Are you, are you, do you like meat? And I'm like, yeah, I eat meat, I eat ground beef. I eat anything, I just, just another reason why I'm weird. But anyways, after the show, Lumonati's, and I think we're gonna get Mrs. Fields cookies. I'm really excited. Knowing that the show's not that big, the nerves kind of like were coming in waves and going away yesterday. But, you know, this has been just the funnest experience ever. I lost 10 pounds to be here at this point, you know? It's like, I might not be the most shredded person ever, but I feel great and deserving and I cannot wait to be on stage. Deserving to be on stage, you know, like represent myself, not ne not necessarily to win, but you know, just, just to be beautiful on stage and look gorgeous and feel glamorous today. So I'm excited, win or lose, this is gonna be such a fun experience. I'm really happy I was able to vlog the whole thing. And uh, last night Mariana came with me get my tan. I am so dark. My tan isn't, isn't on my face, but my body is so dark. So I need to go match my face and make this look nice. And then we shall move to the venue. And then I'll have, I probably will have my parents or my brother recording me at the venue. So hopefully they do a good job. So if show day footage sucks, we know who to blame. And they're probably watching this video right now. So if it sucks, Sam's fault.
fan fault. Well, I finished my makeup and now I'm on my way to the venue. I really like how I did my makeup. The eyelashes definitely make it more dramatic. This is gonna be an experience. I'm really excited, getting kind of nervous, but a little fun. I feel pretty. <laughs> bread too. Pretty excited. My support team. 102. Gotta yell louder. <laughs> with everything honestly if I would have got last place I would have been happy I think you guys understand that by now my personality is just kind of enjoy what you're doing and it doesn't and it will pay off and you'll have fun in the long, long run um, I definitely fell in love with competing I loved meeting people backstage you got to know so many different walks of life so many different body types so many different people came from different places some people prepped for 
you know, 32 weeks and lost 60 something pounds. Some people, some guys prep for a week and just did water retention, whatever, you know, like sodium, blah, blah, blah. And they looked amazing. You know, everyone's just different and has their own path. So some people use meal plans, some people use flexible dieting. It was so cool. I had so much fun. This was a blast. I had half of my peanut butter Snickers after the show because I didn't even, I wasn't even hungry before the finals. So I had half of that. And now I'm gonna go have some pizza. Through the highways, through my shadow, towards the sun rays, and I didn't know.